Mallory making time out of her very busy schedule before her performance tonight at Dueling Hall with our very own 2023 Mississippi Songwriter of the Year winner. I'm talking about Naomi Taylor. Tickets, again, are $10. You can go to kicks96news.com. I'll have the story up where you'll be able to actually connect to the link directly to purchase your tickets. You can also follow her on Facebook as well as Dueling Hall. Make sure that you stop by, give them a follow, give them a like. But I look at the talent that you have. Growing up in the family that you have, I'm sure that there was a lot of advice given to you growing up. I've always been a big stickler with telling my children, friends, and coworkers, and it's a philosophy I've adapted of my own. Surround yourself with people who are better than you because what that does is, is it challenges you. It makes you better, and it makes the impossible possible because the first two letters of impossible are I am, and you can turn impossible into I'm possible. For when, sure. when you look at some of the friends that you have and some of the the resources that you have with Danny, mm-hmm. CDJ. How inspiring is that to have friends like that? It's just, well, it's incredible. I feel so fortunate to have, you know, cheerleaders outside of my family. Right. And, uh, Danny, like you said, is one of them. Danny has been a close friend of mine for a very long time. And, and then our relationship just kind of evolved into, she was my radio promoter, still is. Mm-hmm. Uh, and now she's my, my manager. So, um, she honestly, I could say she works harder for me than I work for me, which, which <laughs> says a lot. She's, she's definitely my biggest cheerleader. And, uh, and then CDJ, like you mentioned, Carolyn Don Johnson, I've been the biggest fan of Carolyn forever. Oh yes. I actually opened for her in Canada with my family band. I talked about earlier, the Cormiers and we opened for her years ago. And so it was just pretty full circle to move to Nashville and then actually get an opportunity to have a writing session with her and then record that song and then have her come sing background vocalist on that song. And then we're playing shows together. So it's, uh, it's been some really big pinch me like validating moments. And, um, and going back to, again, what you said about, you know, wanting to surround yourself with more than like, yes, people, um, people that are going to make yourself better. Um, those women are two women, especially that, You know, they'll give it to me straight. Um, Mm -hmm. You know, I can learn so much from Carolyn, and Danny is a sounding board for me. And when she's not feeling something, I don't take that as an insult. I'm like, okay, I can do better. I can better myself. So, so yeah. It it comes down to timing sometimes. I mean, it might just not be the right moment. Oh, for sure. For sure. Timing is such an important puzzle piece. I mean, you can have all the ingredients, but if they don't mix well, then it's not going to happen. Right. Um, But, yeah, I mean, I think... Like you said, it's very important to um, to surround yourself with not just people who inspire you, but people who do make you better. Yeah. Um, and if we go back to that to that writing songwriting example, it's like you know you never want to be the best writer in the room. You want to have people who are better than you because they make you better. 